Thank you. Um, so this is the five P's of civic tech, and this is my buddy, Adam. Um, so we can just go ahead and get started. So this is me um, in a penguin suit, and uh, I am a student at the University of Chicago and a Microsoft civic tech fellow. But at Shy Hack Night, I lead two beginner-friendly breakout sessions. One is Civic Tech 101. And as you can see here, it's kind of like the welcome wagon slash onboarding session for those of you that are new to Civic Tech. Actually, can we just get a show of hands of who's here for the first time? All right, give it up for these guys. Come on. So thank you for being interested. And um, if you are interested in Civic Tech, Shy Hack Night, and really what we do best here in Chicago, which is using tech for the public good. Highly recommend coming to that. Um, the next session I lead is uh, called Manatee Tank. And uh, Manatee Tank is the nice, friendly, civic tech version of Shark Tank. Um, it's just this place to throw around app slash startup ideas, do some user experience testing, as we did with Tom's data portal. Um, and, you know, just a friendly place to throw some ideas around. Uh, funnily enough, it used to be called Dolphin Tank, but that was actually copyrighted. And also, dolphins are pretty nasty in nature, so, like, just, just a note. Um, but in both of these two groups, I do a lot of explaining about what civic tech is. And in the theme of five years forward, five years back, um, five years that this is actually a Microsoft Corp presentation, and I'll use accusations, um, I wanted to come up with a framework known as the five Ps. And I wanted to look at the five Ps um, as a way of looking at where Shy Hack Night was, is, and will become. So I'll start off with the first P. Uh, which is policy. And, you know, five years ago when uh, Mayor Rahm Emanuel created a policy to have a Socrata open data portal to make Chicago the first city to have a CDO, um, opening up FOIA logs, opening up data, opening up um, really APIs, that was a catalyst and Kickstarter for this community. Next, we have people. Um, and it's pretty clear through all the mantras that we have, such as build with, not for, and people, not code, are the heart of this community. It says a lot. Um, introductions are really important at Shy Hack Night because each of us come from a different background and neighborhood, but we're all united by that motivation to do good with tech. Um, afterward, we have presence, right, um, with a misplaced E. Um, so presence, it describes a lot of things. It describes Smart Chicago Collaborative funding and documenting our journey. It describes the presence of government community leaders um, like Tom, Cook County Bureau of Technology, et cetera, showing up and making a two-way street um, between government and citizen. And of course, the presence of you all here, because um, we realize that the human interaction showing up week to week in person is what makes us productive. That leads us to the next P, um, putting it all together is productivity, what really sets Chicago apart. I can go on and on about all the things that have gone out of this community, from M Relief to um, the E. coli project to the Illinois Budget Clock, on and on. But the conclusion really is that there's a lot of things going on here, and we have something really special here. But let's just take a minute and say, how many of you knew every single word and concept that I just talked about? Very few, right? That was just a ton in like a short minute. Um, and that kind of leads me to my next P, um, because it's <laughs> pun boarding. Um, and if, if you haven't noticed, it's just onboarding with a P. I'm not a linguist or English major, but um, pun boarding. So what is it exactly? Um, I want to start with the next, um, what I ask everyone who comes to Civic Tech 101 and Manatee Tank, which is, why are you at Shy Hack Night? So these are some of the answers. Um, one is, I want to contribute through my knowledge or code. I want to learn more, and some are a little bit honest about this, some are a little more subtle about it, but I come here for the free food. Um, and as a starving, poor college student, I can definitely empathize with that. Um, you guys are one of my main sources of sustenance. <laughs> but, you know, in all of these sentences, it doesn't really contain the complexities and depth of what people have to offer the civic tech community in Shy Hack Night, right? Um, we have people, like, what would Shy Hack Night be without the transportation experts, the data scientists, those who do the community organizing work, right? But these sentences, they don't contain any of that. Um, and all that I presented, it was, a, it was very scary. It was intimidating, right? Um, and so pawnboarding is kind of the process of, you know, how do, we, how do we fix that? How do we remove those barriers of entry? Um, and so it's a constant process. Um, and so here are some of the things. Um, and 
I'm not, I'm not the only one to talk about this. Uh, Victor did a presentation about introducing and documenting your code. Uh, we can make bridges between learning groups and working groups. Pause for questions. This is a time for people to ask questions and not feel judged. Um, bring friends. I think everyone should just be like Steve Vance and bring like all their friends, because he's done an amazing job of that. <laughs> um, and say hello to a stranger, right? Um, we can all be friends here. So, And I'll just conclude it really by saying, um, I compare Chicago Civic Tech and Shy Hack Night a lot to The Breakfast Club. Um, we have a lot of different backgrounds, right? Um, and we also write occasional letters to authority, the principal slash the mayor, right? In the form of blog posts and code. Um, and uh, I think we have something really special here, and I think I speak for everyone that inclusion is a really important thing. But with inclusion, um, actually, I'm going to tell you a little bit of story. Uh, when I was a small wee lad, I wasn't part of the cool kids club. And um, <laughs> well, I find my place uh, here at Shy Hack Night is my cool kids club. And I think we can make that place um, a cool kids club for everyone. So let's think about onboarding, pawnboarding, uh, the next time we have an event. Thank you very much, guys.